Also, as of tonight, Kootenai Health once again close to capacity. The hospital now sitting at 97% full. At this hour, they're caring for 39 coronavirus patients, 13 of which require critical care. That is a significant jump just in the last 24 hours, adding five new COVID patients and two more in critical just since yesterday. Now today, Krem2 got a copy of these letters drafted and signed by nearly 200 healthcare workers at Kootenai Health aimed at the Coeur d'Alene Mayor and City Council, and it is expressed support for a mask mandate. They said in part, while we are doing our best to educate our community and encourage them to use best practices for preventing the spread of COVID-19, this effort has not been enough. Then physicians within the hospital system also wrote a separate letter saying the past seven months have been exhausting, but it now appears the battle is just beginning. The surge in COVID-19 cases that we have seen locally in the past seven days exceeds the first uptick that we experienced in July and does not appear to be slowing. Now the hospital says it is at a tipping point and already unable to fully respond to the needs of the community. Officials say they've started canceling elective surgeries. They're struggling to admit new patients and are even declining transfers from smaller hospitals. Just yesterday, we told you how Kootenai Health is expanding its COVID unit to solely take care of additional coronavirus patients. Administrators say it's necessary to manage this latest surge of new cases across the panhandle.